all right what is going on welcome to the channel all right quick video for you guys here today we're gonna attempt a self-driving video we're gonna go to the chick-fil-a if anyone is familiar with this area i'm trying to go to the other side of the shopping center and this is a pretty difficult drive um granted it's um evening time right now so it should be a little bit easier we're gonna let fsd do its thing here all right systems are ready to be engaged what we're gonna do is we're gonna go from this parking spot to chick-fil-a to see how fsd decides to get me there all right and it starts off by going right right and then left i probably would have went right but it decides left, so we're just gonna go with it. Let's see what it does now. All right, we got a car with the hazards on and it needs to go around this car and it does. It does a pretty good job at it. Nice job recognizing the people there. All right, so it got me into this path here. It recognizes this car backing out. It's waiting for him. It proceeds. Now it sees this car. All right, let's proceed here. So we want to go past the speed bump. Nice job. All right, so we're actually trying to make a left over here. And this is a very interesting left turn. It's going to make a left into the access road. And uh, let's see how it does here. Oh no, it's actually going to decide to go ahead and make a left onto um, Drainsville. I'm surprised it went this way this time instead of just going ahead and making a, a left onto the access road. But anyways, here we go. We, um, I'm so surprised it did that. I actually wanted to challenge it a little bit more and go through the access road a little bit. But... Anyways, it switched lanes during the lane, during the left turn right there, like the quick lane switch, and now it's gonna, now I know it can fi finish this try, but let me actually try to challenge it a little bit more by seeing if we can instead, I'm gonna go ahead and take over here, we're gonna try to do a U-turn, we're gonna plug in something over here to make us do a u-turn so let's see if we can drive back to the giant here and it knows it's on the other side so because it's all in that shopping center anyway so i'm just trying to get back there and it's already hitting me with the unable to complete maneuver please assist now interesting if you can see that right there it says Unable to complete maneuver, please assist now. Now, will it be able to actually hit this U-turn? I think it should. I've seen um, version 12 do plenty of U-turns already. This should be uh, no different. Not sure why it's giving me that. But I think we're going to soon find out here why exactly it's saying unable to complete maneuver. But... Hopefully, um, hopefully it does this U-turn and gets me back into the shopping center as I wanted it to. I actually didn't want to leave the shopping center in the first place. And um, I was just trying to, you know, do some FSD tests within the shopping center. And it, it left thinking that that was the easiest way to get back to Chick-fil-A, which it kind of was. But I was trying to put it through complex challenges. So now I'm trying to do a u-turn since it it tried to ease its way out of the complex challenge i'm putting it into a new complex challenge so it's presenting me with this unable to complete maneuver but let's see what it does all right whether or not i gotta hit the uh accelerator or even press it we're gonna find out here in just a second and if I do, I will, and I'll let you know. And if I don't, I'll let you know. The car does it itself. And we should get a green light. And no accelerator presses needed whatsoever. 
the car did the U-turn beautifully, hit me with the red hands, but it, it, it handled that really nice, it, it's doing the lane switches perfectly, it switched lanes like three times, it's even got to switch one more lane over now and cut back into the shopping center from where we, we began the video. And uh, yeah, overall, it just it did a really nice job. Oh no! Look, it's a, it was about to get into a crash here. I have the right of way. With that, really, it was that person's fault. That person was continuing. I mean, FSD. I. Oh my gosh! I don't even know what just happened right there. That was that my fault. Was that their fault? Was that FSD's fault? I think that was their fault. Really, they should have been waiting because. Incoming traffic has a right of way on that intersection right there. And what? I don't even know what went wrong. I'm going to have to check the tape on that one. Um, I'm in real time right now, so I can't, obviously. But I'm just surprised. Like, uh, I, ho I was really expecting no takeovers there. But, okay. Here we are. We're back at the Giant. And we're going to end the video here on a auto park. So let's see if we can go ahead and grab this VIP spot with the gentleman here. As soon as he gets out of the way, should be able to... Oh, look, the P pops up. So shift to reverse and hit start. And let's see, this is hardware three, V12. Let's compare this to... Maybe that's hardware four going up over there as a Model X doing some backup parking. I wonder if it's doing an auto park there. And if we're competing, I definitely beat them because look how awesome it did at that park job. That was perfect. It only took a few seconds. Okay, maybe they did beat me because they forward and parked. But anyways, auto park is awesome. It worked it works great on um reverse park for hardware three and on hardware four it works unbelievable for reverse and parallel park but yeah anyways hit that like button if you enjoyed this video um subscribe for more fsd challenges and thanks again for watching hope you have a great rest of your day